Good morning, everyone. I just ate breakfast. I hope I don't have peanut butter on my face. Um, I had oatmeal for breakfast and um, I'm still like in pajamas, my hair's a mess, but I wanted to stop out here and share with you guys um, what we're doing. So we have needed to have our front porch replaced for so long. Um, it's really falling apart and just not great. We ended up making it so that um, nobody could walk on the porch because it's just kind of dangerous. And today the contractor is coming to start working on our porch. So yeah, really excited about that. So I just wanted to share before with you what it looks like. So last night we went through and we cleared off the porch and this is what it looks like right now. Um, it's a really a decent sized porch. And um, from the time that we bought the house, we knew we were gonna have to replace it. Um, as you can see over here, there are some floorboards that have rotted away. Um, but like the railing looks great. The columns are also great. Those like pillars are really in great condition. Um, and also we are going to have the steps replaced too. Um, the steps are really not in great condition. Um, so yeah, you can see some more rotting wood over here. And like these boards move a lot in like the different kinds of weather. So yeah. Really looking forward to having this project done. Hi everyone, it's Kieran and Sean. We, yo. yo, we are at our house and we actually have something really exciting. We have a new uh, front porch because the other front porch was falling apart. And so we placed the order when Sean like last August and there just really weren't that many supplies available so um, we finally were able to get the lumber and everything and by we I mean our contractor and um, he came in he did the project last week so I'm just gonna share with you guys what it looks like and we are going to start painting today so excited all right so here are the steps the steps were something that really needed to be replaced so we have the steps and we kept the same um, railing and the railing over there and this is what it looks like. It's so nice. So yeah, we are going to start painting. So I got some supplies at Walmart and Finley's Barking. There's the tripod. And this is the paint we're using for the decking, right? That's what you would call it? Yeah. The floor. Um, and we got it in this slate gray color. So we're going to start by tonight. We're only going to put um, paint on the deck tonight. I'm just going to see what the paint looks like. Ooh, I like it. It looks really thick, but that's what we wanted, right? Yeah. I'm going to stir it. Okay. So stir, stir, stir. Oh yeah, it's thick. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's so thick. It looks like pudding. Wow. But that's what like an exterior paint is, right? Mm -hmm. This is exciting. Ew. <laughs> it's so thick. I see what you mean about because this one says it's textured. It almost looks like it has like sander or something in it. Oh, it's gonna drip down, Sean. Um, do you have the plastic? You know what? I actually don't think it will. <laughs> uh, it's going slowly. We should probably put something underneath it. All right, Sean has the paint. This is nerve wracking. This is what we wanted, right? Yeah. Textured? Yeah, right? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> it's so thick. It doesn't want to like turn over. It's so heavy. Oh, well, I think if I start rolling it, it'll be. Okay. <laughs> Ooh. It's going to look good. Right? Mm -hmm. Is that like a hair or something in it? 
go with that. Oh. But I think when it dries, it'll be different, yeah. you know. Awesome. It's strong smelling. It'll probably dry lighter, right? Yeah. You don't think so? No. Are you afraid we are? No. You would say something. matches like the, with it right now it like almost exactly matches the the house which is crazy yeah I'm actually gonna need more sooner than I thought do what I'm gonna need more sooner than I thought okay that's okay it's like look it's not <laughs> is it is it anything wrong with it We need two, right? Another gallon? Yeah. Maybe. Maybe. This was the only one they had at Walmart. That sucks. We'll be able to find it somewhere else though, for sure. Hi everyone, so for the rest of this video I'm going to do a voiceover because I don't know if you can tell in this footage but it's very windy um, when we were filming this. We've had a lot of wind here in New York so I just wanted to film a voiceover or record a voiceover just so you guys can actually hear what I'm saying about the porch. So um, what we are doing is we're painting the decking of the porch this gray color that has like a texture to the paint, um, almost like a sand. It feels like a sand quality in the paint and it's very thick and we're doing gray for that part um, and then we are going to be you'll see in future videos we have painted the steps a couple different colors we're using black and white for the steps and later on in the video you actually see that we have worked on the the railing um, I think they're called those like posts oh my gosh I can't think of what they're called right now the little bars on the the railing it comment below if you know what I'm talking about for some reason the word is just I can't think of it um, but we're painting those black and then the top of the railing is going to be white so we have a lot of painting still left to do but we did do two coats of this um, decking paint and we really do like how it looks it gives like a lot of great protection to the deck and that's something you know we really really want to try to keep this deck as you know nice as possible um, just because it was really not working well for a while so um, we went through and did a second coat on the deck with this uh, this paint and then um, it definitely was a little tricky because the paint was really really thick as we were talking about earlier and um, so we just took our time with it and we Sean had like a roller on like a on a broom or like a long like broom handle kind of thing to help with like the bigger parts of, of the paint and um, we saw that this stuff actually dries pretty quickly we did wait I want to say almost a week in between painting the two coats 
Um, first of all, we had to find another uh, another gallon of it. I don't know if you if you heard us say in the video that there was only one at our local Walmart, Walmart so we had to go to another Walmart to find some more of it, but that Walmart actually had a ton of it. So um, this was our first time working with something thick like this, but it really does feel like it's giving really good protection to the porch, um, which is really important. Something else that we're noticing with the porch is that there is a lot of damage that we still need to correct. Mainly the, the contractor was taking our porch and making it like stru structurally safe, um, you know, because there was a lot, there were a lot of areas that were rotted. So that was the main goal of his part of the job. Um, and as you can see here, I am painting the railing black, which I think it looks so cool. This is a different brand of paint. It's an exterior paint, but it's a different brand. And I think that it looks so nice. Sean actually had the idea of painting um, the railings black. And so I think it's a great idea and I really like how it looks. Um, but at, back to what I was saying, there are some parts of the porch that aren't structural that do have some damage to them. You've probably seen um, some paint that's chipping and things like that. Uh, that was something that we really didn't want to worry too much about for this project. Our goal was to have um, the porch strong and safe to walk on because for a long time it wasn't. So um, you'll see us working on some projects that really, you know, some people might have wanted to have other parts replaced. That's all I can really say about it. You know, like, I don't know how to describe it. Like. We wanted, the, the the focus for us was making it safe to walk on versus having everything look pristine and perfect condition. Um, you'll see like later on there are some, I'll show you in um, video, there are some parts of the ports, like some boards that are rotted away a little bit, but they're not structural at all. Um, they're just like decorative. So I know like, I don't know, we, we had a budget and we wanted to make sure we stayed within the budget and um, we just wanted to make it so that we could walk on it and really use it. So um, we have finished the decking completely and we also just finished painting this part of the railing and in the next v videos I want to share with you um, painting the top of the railing, painting the columns, painting the steps. Um, we are also going to be working on some of the lattice on the bottom of the porch. It's definitely taking longer than I thought it would. Um, we've been working on it for a few weeks now and especially painting these, it was so tedious. Um, but once you get like a system, it really, you know, doesn't take too long. It's just tiring. So um, that's really pretty much it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give this video a thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this. I would really like to start sharing more of these DIY videos with you and stay tuned because I will be sharing um, more videos of this project. And if you haven't subscribed already, please do. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.